on this episode, we've also got uh, Congressman John Lewis, you know, who we've, we've talked about a little bit earlier. And, you know, you open the book with, with you walking across the Edmund Pettus Bridge with him. I ask, you know, because one of the things that we were trying to figure out in this episode, and we'll, we'll come to no definitive answer because there is no definitive answer, you know, it's like, can our region ever reconcile itself and be redeemed from the evils of its past? Uh, and... When I asked, so I asked Congressman Lewis specifically because I had read, and I and, and by that point I had read it at least a dozen times. That opening chapter of your book where all that is described, because I I found myself just wanting to read it over and over again because I felt like it did my heart good, you know. Mm. It gave me some hope. No, yes, and. So I asked him, and this was only last week, I asked him uh, to talk about what it meant to him to walk across that bridge with you hand in hand on that day. Uh, and if you don't mind, I want to I play what he said okay. to me. To walk across the Emmett Pettus Bridge Many years later, after Bloody Sunday, with Governor Wallace's daughter, meant so much, not just to me, but to hundreds and thousands of people all across the South and all across America. We walked hand in hand, and the act made me cry. It, it, it made me cry. It's the ability and the capacity of people can come together as brothers and sisters. What does that make you feel? Well, I love John Lewis and everything he is. He, he calls me sister and I call him brother. We grew up 38 miles from each other but we were oceans. Our lives were oceans apart. When I crossed that bridge with him, it was a, a turning point in my life. Yeah. Yes. And he showed me that unconditional love and reconciliation and forgiveness can heal a human heart, and pull something into you that's good and real. And he was good and real to me. He pulled me over to the side, and we looked over into water. And he said, now, sister, we need to move on. Mm -hmm. That, to me, meant we move forward. Right. He's always saying, we, we can't go back. We have to move forward. And, and there y'all went together. Yes. On that historic day. Yes. 